This is the abbey and village of Mont Saint-Michel in Normandy, France, bearing a striking resemblance to St. Michael's Mount in Penzance Bay, Cornwall. It's not unusual for fortresses to have systems whereby goods could be brought up to them along ramps and along rails. However, here, a very unusual system. They have a sledge tramway. It hasn't been used for many years, however, it's still intact. Between the 1840s and the 1860s, Mont Saint Michel was a penitentiary, a prison. There were over a thousand prisoners and staff living within it. This necessitated the transport of large quantities of food and other materials up into the abbey itself. The track consists of a huge buttress with two grooves on the top along which the sledge would slide. One wonders how many people died in the process of building it. It may have served some extra function in providing ancillary support for the walls of the abbey. The sledges are very robust, made of very thick wood and partial iron runners. Presumably too much iron along the base would wear away the surface of the stone. The use of stone for track is very unusual. Perhaps the best known example is that of the Hator Granite Tramway in Devon. The motive power for the sledge was that of a tread wheel powered by two or more prisoners who would walk on the inside. The rope system is fairly sophisticated with a trundle wheel that ensured that the rope wound up correctly on the main axle. 